Hi, welcome to another Priscilla open house tour. My name is Julia and today I'll be showing you around this sprawling house and lot here in BF Homes, Paranaque. But first, make sure you hit like, click subscribe and click on the bell so you get notified for whenever we release new YouTube videos. Of course, we're on Facebook, so make sure you hit like and see first and follow us on Instagram at Priscilla underscore official. Okay, follow me and we'll go inside the house. Okay, so right off the bat, you can see here that the lot is wide. So, palapad siya. The good thing is, it's not just palapad, it's also deep. Upon entering the main gate, you have here your outdoor receiving area that leads into your uh, main entrance. Of course, here you can set up a more private uh, sitting area, perfect for entertaining guests. And I mentioned this because you will have a lot of that throughout the house. But for now, this is, you know, your, um, <laughs> your nook number one, sort of. Okay, anyways, here on the covered area, you have a two-car port with a door that leads out into the side of the house, which I will show you later. But for now, let's check out the rest of the front part or front yard. So I mentioned earlier na yun nga palapad yung uh, lot. So over here, you can see. You have so much ground to uh, to walk on. So you have again your front yard and this gorgeous sparkling swimming pool. And of course you can see here a huge entertainment area. So you can set up a bar or more um, you know sitting areas or like clusters of it or just one really big one perfect for entertaining guests and family for when they come over. <laughs> and you have here access to the uh, indoor living areas and a den or bedroom please excuse the motor running by <laughs> which again i will show you later for now let's explore the outdoor side and over here sige go <laughs> you have an indoor or a spacious toilet and bath so this one you can use for the swimming pool although that one's actually dedicated for the driver's lounge or um, quarters because over there by the corner medyo hindi lang yata kita sa camera you have an outdoor shower area. So that's what you use to before you get into the pool and out after. Okay, over here, you have the actual uh, driver's quarters. So, medyo may konting gamit lang sa floor. <laughs> and your maid's quarters. And right in front of it, the spacious uh, maid's toilet and bath. Oh, do but it's actually lakanye. So, I see Yeah. Okay, now that we've explored this side of the house, so it's basically the front and side, na open, let's now go through the main entrance and see what other areas of this house has to offer. So, upon entering, you will be instantly directed to the living room or your entertainment area. That's, you know, this time indoors. <laughs> so you've got lots of windows and you've got that access out onto your swimming pool or your outdoor um, entertainment area. Okay, so you, oh, by the way, you've also got lots of um, outlets and basically a bang ready for your entertainment needs. And also over there on that side. And over here, you've got this huge blank wall. You can use a lot of paintings, it's up to you. And then over here, you've got your dedicated dining area as made obvious by this lovely chandelier <laughs> hanging off the ceiling. And right in front of it, you've got your uh, inspiring indoor or formal kitchen. So you can put your double door refrigerator over there. You've got your range, your double drain sink. Of course, your hood on top of the stove. And then I say that this is your formal kitchen because over here outside this door, you've got your huge informal kitchen so you've got this sprawling counter tiled counter and then over here you have a door that leads out onto your two car port and then over here you've got more space for whatever it is you want to put out in here Meron pa siyang paloob, but this one is for your utility so nandito yung breakers or your your panels electrical panels so easy maintenance and okay now that we're done with this floor <laughs> or this area we're going to go one step up. <laughs> now, this one denotes your more private spaces. So, on the first door to your right, you have a guest powder room. Yeah, so, very accessible to your guests. 
and hindi siya yung immediate na mapapasukan mo upon entering the private areas. So you have here door number one, which is you know, bedroom number one. So you've got lots of space. This huge window that again looks out onto your um, entertainment area or your swimming pool. Across, you've got your built-ins and your storage spaces and your in-suite toilet and bath. So this one is in a nice light gray color. Okay, now out onto the hall, mapapansin nyo, it's an interesting shape, but it's not claustrophobic at all. But before we go into the master bedroom, I want to show you bedroom number two first. So again, you've got lots of space. You've got that huge window looking out into the swimming pool. Counter, or sorry, uh, storage spaces. Yeah, and so it's already ready built. You can put in your stuff now. So as you can see, this house is fully, um, fully finished, but not fully furnished. In other words, you have all the liberty to design it without having to think of, you know, how to finish it. <laughs> so you got your in-suite toilet and bath, which basically looks like your other bathroom, except this one used a darker gray. So what's nice about this house is, although the design is generally consistent throughout the house, you will find these little details that make each room different from the others. So, I don't know. In a house, that's very, it's fun to look out for. Yeah, so there's another step down, which means it's the end of the more private spaces, at least in this area. So before we go there, let me show you the master bedroom. Yeah, and it's like you've got lots of space. You've also got this huge window, which isn't actually just a window. It's it's essentially a sliding door that leads out onto your own outdoor um, outdoor area. So this is very private. Dina, paglumabas ako wash out ako na. And yeah. Ayun, so mataas yung walls niya so your neighbors can't pry in, pry looking in. <laughs> then over here you've got your walk-in closet. And to the left, you've got your end suite, master's toilet and bath. So you've got your his and her sinks, your um, your shower area and your throne. And this huge window that again looks out onto your outdoor um, area. So again, high walls, not even your own, because itong bahay na to meron siyang slightly higher elevation. Not even that part of the house can look down in here. So it's a very nice, you know, open but very private space for masters of the house. Now I'll get to showing you that higher level that I was talking about. But for now, let's check out the door right next to the master bedroom. So one step down. This is more of a utility area this time. So mas maganda dito yung laundry area. So again, it's very private. You've got high walls. You can do your laundry here privately and comfortably. Like in a washing machine, dryer, jan, and then hang your clothes to dry without your neighbors seeing them or stealing them. <laughs> then again, this is a very good neighborhood. Very quiet. Very secure. Then again, this isn't the kind of subdivision na basta basta lang. You have to go through two gates to get here. So, talk about security, right? Okay, now before we go into the room, which I earlier mentioned also leads out into the swimming pool, let's check out this staircase that leads up onto the, um, well, I guess you could say second floor, somewhat. It's more of a mezzanine, but it's not that low. <laughs> okay, so this is actually bedroom number four. So it's got this gorgeous view of your neighborhood and your water tank. <laughs> so your maintenance niya siguro pwede na rin dito idan since it's more accessible that way. Ayun. And it also has an in-suite toilet and bath. And this adorable built-in for closet space. Yeah. So this one actually, if you wanted, you could turn it into your office. So it can be a bedroom, it can be an office. If you want a more private space that's slightly away from your from your home, so it's like a home office, diba? Para hindi siya super nakadikit sa bedroom mo. Because, you know, a lot of us would prefer that our offices be in the house, but not like right next to our bedroom, you know what I mean? So this would be the perfect space to do it. Okay. So of course, you've also got a bit of space under the stairs for storage. And then over here, you've got bedroom number five, which also has an ensuite toilet and bath. 
Now, of course, again, since this room does lead out into the swimming pool and out into your um, outdoor entertainment area, you could turn this one into a more, you know, cozy family area instead of a bedroom. But uh, you know, easy, easy access for your all your entertainment areas. So that's something to consider and just shows you how versatile this place could be. Now, there are certain things that make you richer by not having them. You know what I mean? So this is clearly a bungalow with one room that's like on the second floor. So is that something that makes you feel better about, you know, your lot? Para ba siyang mas, you know, is it more fulfilling for you to have a lot and a single floor house that's sprawling versus quote unquote maximizing your lot and building several levels? So comment down below what kind of house that you prefer. Okay, let's talk numbers. So you've got 560 square meters of floor area, and 525 square meters of lot area. So if this house seemed big to you, it's because it is. <laughs> so you've got lots of you know, open spaces, lots of entertainment areas, a huge swimming pool. You've got five bedrooms, five toilet and baths, a separate maid's quarters and her own toilet and bath, and a driver's quarters with his own toilet and bath a powder room, a two-car port. What else do you have? Um, all right, it's in a subdivision that's super quiet and peaceful, save for that motor that ran by earlier, but that's fine. <laughs> I mean, you have to have these tricycles to, you know, for you to be able to maneuver inside villages, you know, effectively, right? So you have that. And again, this is in BF Homes, Paranaque. So if you want to see this for yourself, please do send us a message or go to our website at www.presello.com. Invest in your future. Invest with us. Invest with Presello. Hey guys, thanks for watching our video. If you haven't already, subscribe to our channel by clicking on this link. And make sure you hit the bell icon so you get notified for all our videos. And if you want to see more, just click on this and this. See you on the next vid. Am I supposed to go? Okay. <laughs>